All right, welcome back everybody to Altcoin Daily. My name's Austin. In today's video, I wanna share with you possibly the biggest buying opportunity for Bitcoin happening now, as well as five altcoins making news that are about to go crazy. If you're interested in making money with cryptocurrency and learning about cryptocurrency, click subscribe and let's jump in. The first thing I wanna share with you is a two minute clip that usually the average retail investor would not have the opportunity to see. Listen to heavily respected gold bug, Lawrence Leppard, share why Bitcoin over gold is the biggest opportunity from an institutional level. This is a full two minute clip, watch this. I mean, it's entirely possible that they are gonna just keep on doing stim, you know, the Fed balance sheet is gonna to go to 100 billion or 100 trillion, and you know, gasoline's gonna cost $100. I mean, we could go the Venezuela route where you know, they keep the system going, but the inflation, I mean, we're not just talking three or four or 5% inflation, of course, that's what they report, but in reality, it's closer to 10. You know, it's, it, it, it's a real, it's, it's a problem. Let's close <laughs> the conversation back on sound money now. You've yeah. given me a few assets already, gold, silver, mining companies, oil. You also mentioned to me offline Bitcoin. Yeah, you like I'm, a, Bitcoin. I'm a big proponent of Bitcoin. And unfortunately, a lot of people in the gold business, um, are, you know, don't take the time to understand and study Bitcoin, and they should. And what I would say that is, is it's an incredible innovation. Because if you think about what money is, money is nothing more than a ledger. I mean, before we had gold or currencies or anything else, we sat in caves and we kept score of, I killed one bison, you killed two bison, you owe me one, you know, et cetera. So money is just a way of keeping track of who owes who what, right? right. And if you can create a digital ledger that is immutable and can't be cheated on, that's arguably, arguably even sounder as, as a form of money than gold because it's triple entry accounting. Everyone can see it. Whereas with gold, they've managed to corrupt the gold price because the central banks have got control of, of, of the banks and the banks have control of the gold and they've created a lot of paper gold. So, so in, a, in a sense, what that makes is it makes Bitcoin as the only, there's the loudest monetary fire alarm in the system right now. So, you know, one of the things I would say to you is most gold bugs feel the way I do, which is they're astounded that here we are with the most massive money printing operation in the history of the world. I mean, 30% of the money in existence has been created in the last year and a half, two years, yeah. right? And yet gold's not at all time high. I mean, what's up with that, right. right? I mean, it should be, you know, and yet Bitcoin noticed. I mean, Bitcoin went from 10 to 60, right? Okay, what do you think? Like it, support it, get this information out to as many people as possible. And what this tells me is number one, we are early, clearly. And number two, these are the discussions happening in the boardrooms, in the meetings, behind closed doors, at an institutional level, globally. Think about that. Moving forward, let's talk about altcoins, starting with coin number five on today's list, Internet Computer. Definity to launch Bitcoin smart contracts on altcoin slash protocol Internet Computer. This is part of a wider scale industry initiative to make Bitcoin usable in DeFi and Web3. I love this. This is set to happen by the end of this year. And to answer the question why, of what benefit will this be to internet computer? Of what benefit will this be to Bitcoin? Well, in a direct quote from Definity founder, internet computer smart contracts will gain access to Bitcoin liquidity and Bitcoin will gain powerful new smart contract functionality without the need for insecure and cumbersome trusted bridging services. So this could be big. A DeFi ecosystem for Bitcoin is a major industry initiative. It would mean the world's most popular cryptocurrency, Bitcoin, could be used for lending, yield farming, derivatives, liquidity pools, and more, just like the current industry leader, Ethereum. And just as a reminder for what is internet computer, the internet computer is designed to act as an alternative to the cloud-based infrastructure of today's World Wide Web. Its ambitious aim is to transform the internet into a giant global computer that will take on the 370 billion cloud computing market by enabling secure, decentralized versions of popular applications such as LinkedIn, TikTok, WhatsApp, etc. So give me your thoughts down below in the comment section. Obviously, with an integration like this, things are about to get crazy. Coin number four on our list today, XRP, 
quick piece of news, the judge has denied Ripple's motion to the SEC employees' crypto transactions disclosed. So Ripple was cut off. We will never ever know what the SEC individual employees invested in. And this all stems when Ripple filed a motion back in August 27th requesting information about whether SEC employees had purchased and traded Bitcoin, Ethereum, and XRP. The United States Magistrate Judge Sarah Netburn rejected this motion on Tuesday. And actually, just to get more specific, this is from before August 27th, because according to the motion, Ripple met with the SEC four separate times beginning on July 8th to request records of the agency's employees' crypto transactions without progress. So what this means to you as a potential XRP holder is that Ripple will have to find another way to prove to the SEC that XRP is not a security. That's, of course, the SEC's point of view. They're the ones that are suing Ripple, and the case is heating up. I'll keep you updated. And next up, coin number three making news. They are expanding to Cardano. They have integrated with Polygon. But the news today is Unilayer. Unilayer, obviously the altcoin I'm talking about. With their upcoming launch of Gaia, their new metaverse, they will be doing an airdrop for all Unilayer holders. We can see a little teaser of this new metaverse right here. And Unilayer is sponsoring this segment of today's video so I can bring you the most accurate information possible. And first off, just as a reminder, what exactly is Unilayer again? Well, just as it sounds, it provides a new layer of possibilities to trade on Uniswap. Unilayer is a new generation decentralized trading platform built on top Uniswap that enables key features for professional level trading with its layer utility token. So basically they add a more robust trading experience for DEXs, focusing on automated swaps, liquidity management, staking, farming, charts and analytics, live order books, and a lot more. Now, they are multi-chain, meaning they're not only on Uniswap Ethereum, they're on QuickSwap, Polygon, they're on PancakeSwap, Binance Smart Chain. But the news today is this, new horizons for blockchain gaming with Gaia Everworld. So a fantasy game just like Axie Infinity, only obviously they're going for better gameplay, Unilayer has decided to shift Minter, which was their upcoming dynamic online NFT marketplace, into the NFT gaming realm and metaverse, Minter is rebranding to Gaia Everworld from this point forward and will now be just one small part of the much bigger metaverse. Gaia Everworld blends classic fantasy narratives with state-of-the-art blockchain and NFT technology. In the multi-realm gaming environment we created, players will be able to use their Gaia Legionnaires to wage campaigns, defend lands, and other immersive activities. So Axie was the proof of concept, they are adding to it, they are creating their own. The two tokens that make the platform work are Gaia, which can be staked, and also GGP, which is needed to breed Gaia. These would be the creatures, I'm assuming. If you want to participate in the airdrop, here are the details. We are committed to attracting new players to the Gaia ecosystem and will be distributing 15 million Gaia tokens via an airdrop on October 31st of this year, this airdrop will distribute 3% of the total supply to Unilayer holders, layer holders, and they are excluding exchanges, which I like. So you must hold a layer token before October 31st, very important, and you must hold a minimum of 1,000 layer on a self-custody wallet. No exchanges will get the airdrop. I will link this down below so you can see all the details for yourself. Big things coming up for Unilayer. I'll keep you updated. And next up, coin number two on today's list is Chainlink. They have just made a major integration with decentralized cloud storage aggregator, Coldstack. Here's why. We're excited to integrate Chainlink's price feeds, ensuring accurate prices for the storages we aggregate, like Filecoin, Arweave, and Sia. We're also happy to use Chainlink's keepers to improve our staking. So big green flag for link holders. And here's the reason. Here is the reason Chainlink was chosen, because in their words, Chainlink is the industry standard in blockchain oracles. And as we aggregate many decentralized storage units, such as Arweave and Filecoin, 
having the most accurate price data is critical to providing users with the most cost-efficient decentralized storage options. In a direct quote from Coldstack CEO, also friend of the channel, there really isn't any substitute for Chainlink. If we want to provide the best data storage solutions for our users, then it makes sense to use the best Oracle service provider in the industry. So obviously, do not count Chainlink out. If you hold link, give me a comment down below, but let's keep moving. And coin number one in today's list, doing very, very big things, is Flow, and here's why. Dapper Labs, the company behind Flow, has just been said to reach a $7.6 billion valuation, as well as just signed a partnership with Spain's top soccer league. Here are the details. Dapper Labs, the company behind NBA Top Shot and the Flow blockchain, has just closed this mega funding round, led by prominent company Koto, as well as also including Andreessen Horowitz, Google's GV, and Version 1 Ventures. So big names are pouring into this, and in a direct quote from the CEO of Dapper Labs, we've proven the concept, which is why our investors are so eager to partner with us. They've seen the success of NBA Top Shot on Flow, and the CEO of Dapper Labs believes non-fungible token highlights will be the currency of fandom, and says the raise will help expand NBA Top Shot operations and lead to new sports ventures worldwide, including European soccer with this huge fan base. And like I said, they've just got a major one. In a separate announcement Wednesday, Dapper Labs announced a partnership with La Liga, Spain's top professional soccer league, to launch a soccer NFT marketplace. The marketplace will feature digital collectibles from the league's 20 teams, including world-renowned clubs Real Madrid and Barcelona. Obviously a major kit, huge for Flow, huge for Dapper Labs. This is major European adoption. And that is the video. Let me know what you think down below in the comment section. And like always, see you tomorrow. Appreciate you.